Let's send it, things over to 27 sports reporter Glenn Kinley for an outlook on today's victory over Duke. Hey Jake, yeah, great game here today. Kansas wins it 35 to 27. You mentioned it's the first time they've started 4-0 since 2009. Get this, it's also just the first time they've won four games in a whole season since 2009. And this year, they do it in the first one-third of the season. Just remarkable stuff. And Kansas, well, this might be the most special of those four wins so far this year because it combines two things, a power five win and a win at home. We haven't seen both of those at once so far this year. The Jayhawks last two wins came on the road. They returned here to David Booth Memorial Stadium and were welcomed back with a sellout crowd. How about 47,233 in attendance? That's the most in almost three years. No doubt about it. It is a special time for anyone and everyone involved with KU football. It was rocking. It was crazy. I mean, to be able to come out there for the intro and then just be able to see the whole entire booth packed out, you'd love to see things like that because that's something that we've been working on. You know, a lot of guys who are older on this team haven't been able to see that for a while. And, you know, to be able to bring that back, bring that type of culture back, we just love seeing that. There's probably times uh, a year ago that when, when it was really tough that we'd say, you know, we'll, we'll, we'll get this thing filled someday. I'm really proud of the way our guys keep, keep progressing and finding ways. It's a win that very, might, very well might put Kansas in the top 25 nationally. Daniels, get this, goes 19 for 23, 324 passing yards, four passing touchdowns, one touchdown on the ground, two, and 84 rushing yards. The Jalen Daniels Heisman hype not going away anytime soon. The part that maybe people need to be talking about more is now that Kansas is just two wins away from becoming bowl eligible, even if they were to go two and six the rest of the way from here, they would still get a bowl game. So no doubt about it, exciting stuff happening here in 